Nick Canby's ready. Thickless. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thickless is my debut. Right <laughs> Are you excited? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Shook it, shook off the nerves a little bit this morning, so now I'm ready to uh, give it my all. Motherfucker. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> Round nose out fifth. Where are you, Ivers? Nine. Eight. Nine. Oh, ninth. Lovely. Very good. Very good. Very, very good. What a treat. Because I, I need one motivation for me is to beat Rauno and Nicholas Stone. <laughs> <laughs> we have training so many times together and yeah. always this motherfucker going after me and beat me like one or two meters. Yeah. Uh, okay. No need to do more. Now. Okay. <laughs> Come before the storm, Lazzy. I know, we were just saying, I think it's the first time it's been a moving event as the first event at Europe's. Yeah. Normally, like the deadlift or the log is set up over there. So it looks a little bit different. Mm. Alright, let's have a listen to this video, please. What's going to happen? <laughs> Do it full well as if it's the opening video. It's 5 p.m. Over to the video! Let's have a listen. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Janasha is not impressed with these handles. They're very small. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Hii ni hivi kwa 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 Tom, could you be so nice person and move? about your predictions you sticking with them I honestly think anyone like has got a good chance at this comp I think it's gonna be very very close yeah. I'm gonna stick with my predictions because you've got to stick with something but there's so many results that could potentially happen wish everyone the best of luck best man will win I think one of a number of guys have a chance mm. I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with who I've said but I think it's gonna be an exciting battle till the end Let's go! 
Trying to keep it nice and steady. You can see the technique there. He's keeping that heavier storm tight against the leg. And the stronger storm in the It started to rotate last year. Yeah, that was. I did the right thing, sorry. I vividly remember saying that someone like Andre could come out. He did indeed, he absolutely smashed it. Yeah. Some good distances there, I think four guys went 20 or more. Yeah, they did. And Andre was just unbelievable. Brilliant start for him, very bad for Alexi. Yeah. Um, but the other guys, like Pavlo did pretty well, Luke was really good, Shane did really well, uh, Ivers, so. It's going to be an interesting one today. It really is. It's such a hard competition to predict. And I don't think we're going to see any records or anything like that today. I just think we're going to see a real battle right to the end. Um, but yeah, Andre, not only can he bowl, not only can he press, <laughs> but he can carry awkward stones as well. Oh, 
Are you going to uh, Myrtle Beach with Gav? I am. Yeah. yeah. Can't wait. Uh, have you been before to Worlds? No, it's your first time. Uh, first time. Two weeks. That's why he's been missing at Worlds. You. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I'm being told, yeah. Uh. <laughs> Secret weapon. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Do you like Car Walk Frederick? Yeah, it's a fun event. Yeah? Good. Like it. So much. Good. So much nerves that I'm going to faint, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. I see. I see they have a good uh, emergency crew here, so I'm going to find. I'm going to find, don't worry. Deadlift ladder, Rambo needs to finish it, and fast. He's up against Big Gab. Come on, Rambo! Faster! Come on! Come on. Faster! Exciting competition so far. There is lots of chopping and changing after each event. I think if Luke can get a good performance on the deadlift here, he's in a great position. Yeah. There's no one dominating anything, so it's quite exciting. Yeah. A couple of athletes don't look as good as maybe. Alexi hasn't looked good so far. Gav, I was expecting more from maybe, still not recovered from his knee. It's tough, strong man's overall. Like, you go from comp to comp and pick up injuries along the way. Every single time someone competes, you kind of think someone will do better, someone will do worse. He's got to keep battling, still halfway through this one, I think. But if Luke does a good deadlift here, with the Viking Breast and the Stones to come, he's going to be hard to beat. Pavlo as well, Pavlo can get a good deadlift. Because I guess notoriously, 
Deadlift is his weakest event. He could be a challenge as well. Good press with Nick Camby on the car walk. I know he's good at Viking press. I think it's still going to be pretty close at the top, but maybe not with who we thought. So as you said, Lossie, the deadlift has uh, really shaken things up and Luke's still on top, but I think it's, what is it, it's three and a half points. 24 and a half, 20, 23, 22, 21, 21. So 24 and a half, 24, yeah. 23 and a half, 23, 22, 22, 21, 21, something like, something like that. Like yeah, that. Super yeah. close between a number of them. Um, I think Alexa's done well actually to get back into the competition after yeah. the stone walk. Um, I think with the last two events, just looking at Viking Press and Stones, Luke is going to be in a good position. However, Nicholas can be really good at Viking Press. Foy 2 is really good at Viking Press. I just feel having the experience of being here before, knowing he's got two good events, Luke is in a good position. I don't see him dropping points. It's going to take a real big performance to take him off the, the top. Uh, Ivers, just always Ivers, just yeah. quietly going about his business, yeah. looking half asleep. Turns out, <laughs> the man just picks up points time and time again. Um, 
Paul's doing really well today. Yeah, Paul's impressed me. Nick Camby is the highest placing right now at this point. Nick Camby has been super impressive. I think he's hurt his bicep. Oh, I don't know if I'm chatting to him, but he looked like he was holding it. Hopefully, that's not going to cost him any issues. Uh, should be fine on the Viking, regardless. It might affect the stones. Yeah. But yeah, Nick has been really, really good. Lots of people said they've got to look out for Nick. And I've known Nick a long time, obviously, watched him as an under 105. Um, saw him come tenth at OSG. And, and this is a much harder lineup here. Like. It's, just, it's, it's tough, you know. Um, he's, he's looking really good. If he can, I think if he can stay top of the guys that haven't qualified, he's going to be end up going to World's Strongest Man, which would be cool to see. Um, yeah, some of the guys not doing as well as maybe we would have expected, but a strong man, you know, it's, it's kind of hard. Like, I love Jin Asher and I want to see him do well again, but he just doesn't seem to be able to bring it to a comp right now. Gavs, I don't know what's going on. Maybe there's something going on that we don't know about. Obviously, he had the knee issue. Not the best events for Gav, either. No, no, they're not, I think, to be fair. And I think sometimes you've got to look at that. Um, but it's an exciting competition and very, very close with, with two events to go. I think it's going to be super tight all the way to the end. I think it's going to come down to the stones. And, um, you know, not just for the win, but for top three, potentially highest place guy that hasn't gone to Worlds. There's still a lot to fight for. Lozzy, please talk me through the scores. <laughs> uh, Alexi's leading overall. Alexi's leading now. Alexi's leading, Andre is second, and Luke is in third. Oh. Close at the top. Wow. Alexi's really come back into this. He's done amazing to get he himself has. back into this. But obviously Stone's potentially with it being a bicep you were, issue. You were right about Andre. The I would try. Thank you. I feel so I, validated. I apologise. Yeah, you should. Sorry, to me, Auntie. to Andre. Sorry, Auntie Liz. Yes, that's okay. I can't I apologise was too right. much to Andre because he kicked my ass at bowling yesterday. So, yeah. You know, yeah. He's young, he's good at bowling, he's winning strong so I but apologise on your hair. behalf. Le oh, Who's there's this? a. Who's this? <laughs> <laughs> It's Maggie. <laughs> it's, it's Lassie. <laughs> Dada. <laughs> Are you feeling overs? Tired? Like always. I got one. Just outside of the podium right now. Need to run go, go finally good event. Then it's good. Then I think I'm in podium. Yeah. Need to do good runs in stones. <laughs> but you're a very good stone lifter, so fingers crossed. Yes, it's possible. Just don't do stupid mistakes. Of course. <laughs> but like uh, right now, I'm, I don't have big pressure about this competition. Then for me, for, uh, more important is vaults. Mm -hmm. Then I think it will look good. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you are the way 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 you
I was tied on the stones of Luke. Lita! What? Go to push. The best of me. Luke was like one point, half point or one point in front of me. So Luke stays in front of me. So it depends how Andre and Alexi do. Andre is like one and a half point behind me. I think so. I didn't. I don't know. Uh, it's really bad. That's what people are saying. He has. I don't know, but that's what people that's are what saying. That's what people are saying. That sucks, man. Yeah. So. Luke won, though. I mean, super exciting between Luke and Ivers, but yeah. that's a shame if that's just happened. Yeah. Happy for Luke, yeah. but got it for Alexi as well. Oh. Right. And Ivers, yeah, Luke, that was super exciting. Yeah. Surprise. Surprise.